I'm your commentator, John Champion, and summarising today is Jim Beglin. So we're off then. Really. Slickly done that. Now a chance for Mikitarian. Oh, he's lost out there. Shinyak. Paye. Balbuena. Balbuena! The goalkeeper to the rescue. Valbuena showed great dribbling ability then, but he obviously has to work on his end product because if he improves on that, he'll be almost unstoppable. Benoit Cheru will swing one in. It's through to Mikitarian. Mikitarian. Possibility here. And they escape imminent danger. Lucas Pichet. Marcel Schmelzer. Jumps for the header. Oh, that's absolutely marvellous! It's a goal. They grab the opener. He's always been a really strong header of a football. Oh, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met and really was. Oh, that's not going anywhere. Out towards the corner flag. Now a chance for Mkhitaryan. The lack of options wasn't an issue, but the lack of quality in the delivery certainly was. And that's been intercepted. Joey Barton. Fanny. Wins it. And the cross heads it. Goal! They lead by two. Devastating. I mean, that's the only word you can use to describe that. That kind of breaking point. Chance to counter-attack here. Slickly done that. Onside. Hits it. Palmed away. Well, that was a really awkward one for the goalkeeper to deal with. Ayu plays it long. The break is on. Oh, fine through ball down the... Shoots. Well, when it becomes that speculative, I think it requires something from the very top drawer, and you have to think a little bit. And there's the end to the first 45. It's a lead, but not a decisive one. 2-0 the score. Marseille set the ball rolling. Papastopoulos. Shinya. And suddenly the defence is on the back foot. It's through. And he finds a bit of space here. Goal, Marseille! Oh, it's in. What a start to the second half this is.
Well, what can you say about... Piszczek. Benoit Sheiru has a hold of him. Oh, that's delightful. Keeper gets a hand on it. Steals it. Here's a chance to get a cross in. Good opportunity for a cross here. Look, this Ginya. The forward push gains momentum. Gignac really has the confidence and skill to be able to hold the ball up like that until support arrives a little sooner. And just maybe there he overdid it slightly and should have released it because the support was arriving quickly. It's through to Mikitarian. Mikitarian, he's onside here. Puts it away. Two goals to the good and they're set fair. harder and the task became too much I think he's got to be a little quicker in his distribution then and, and get others into the match neatly played no options for him in the box oh lovely feet chance possibility here there it is they have a three goal advantage and that should be enough Look, there just wasn't much of a gap to begin with, and to find it, I think it was a fine drive, and I don't think... Knocks it through, over the top. He decides to oh. shoot. Mkhitaryan, break is on, long ball over the top, nice ball through, opportunity for a goal, with what could be a last throw of the dice. That's it, after much consultation with his stopwatch, the referee has blown for time. Victory in both legs sees them advance as comprehensive winners. I think some of the players are going to be a bit sore after that. There was so much passion and commitment out there. I can't remember anyone shirking the tackle. And with that, it's time for me to thank my co-commentator, Jim Beglin, and to wish you a very good evening.